all right so the next step we have another question here question number two so we have y equals to s squared now like i said earlier on whenever you differentiate a variable you have that variable plus change of that word variable then equals to s there is a variable then you have s plus change in word x then raised to the power of what of two so from there this is same thing as y plus change in y equals to we have s plus change in x then s plus change in word s we are having word twice of it so from there we have y plus change in y then equals to then what you are going to do here is to open up the brackets s times s give us s square s times changing s give us s changing x then changing s times s we have what s changing what x changing s times changing s will give us what changing s square mm -hmm. then after that don't forget i say the next step you take is to make changing y the subject of the formula mm -hmm. then become changing y equals to s square plus x changing x plus x changing x then plus changing x squared minus y now this time around you know the value of y y is what x squared you cannot substitute the value for y so we have changing y equals to x squared plus x changing x plus x changing x give us 2x changing what x plus changing x squared then minus our y is representing what x squared so this time and what you do is to collect like things and or you eliminate the what the common tense so it becomes what changing y equals to s square we are having what minus what s square the plus 2 s changing x plus changing s square after that this can cancel out this the next step we have changing y equals to 2 s changing x plus changing s square now the next step you take okay is to divide through by changing x so what you do you divide you divide through by changing x dividing through by changing a become changing y over changing s equals to 2x changing s over changing x then plus changing x square over what changing x then we have changing y over changing s equals to this can cancel add this you will be left with what 2x then plus this cancel add this you will be left with what changing what x then if you observe even after you eliminate or you cancel add changing s you are still having what changing s in the word in the expression so what you are going to do this will take you back to limits so you are going to limit change the s to be what zero it simply that anywhere you see change the s you can substitute the values to be what zero then it becomes limit of changing s approaches zero so we have changing y over changing s equals to the two s plus then our change the s is representing what zero so your final answer becomes dy 